Hey guys, it's Keith Grevenance in the Beat Sessions reviewing Rap Ferreira's new album, Fighting Back. Ferreira has gone by a few other names in his career, but he was born Roy Allen Philip Ferreira and is from Kenosha, Wisconsin, the city that recently had gained some fame uh, from Kyle Rittenhouse and the uh, madness that went on there. Ferreira previously went by Milo, Scallops Hotel, and Black Orpheus, um, but now he's settled on Rap Ferreira. Ferreira has his own record label called Ruby Yacht, which is a play on words on author Omar Khayyam, a Persian poet and astronomer from about a thousand years ago. Ruby Yacht means quatrain, which is hip-hop appropriate. Fighting Back, uh, the first track of this album, is a funky, slow jazz backing track with a smooth saxophone. This track talks about the cosmos and NPCs. This is not mainstream superficial rap. The lyrics are filled with effort and intellect. So this is really, really a good listen. Ours is more of a traditional hip hop beat here, but the lyrics continue to permeate the surface level with poetic distinction. We took to the sky and the sky became ours. We took to the stars and the stars became ours. I like that, that line there. On Consolation, I like the minimalist backing track. Super mellow and smooth. Ferreira even sings a few bars. I know what it means to be. I like the line, well said, my conscience narrated. Uh, Sit Like Kite has a pretty cool backing track that's a neat combination of retro and modern. And I like the German name. My favorite verse uh, says, dreams get stubbed like pinky toes. Mythicizer Instinct is a jazzy backing track with a modern touch again. When Ferrer uses words like credulity, we know he's read a few books and it really does something for him as a lyricist. Ferrer sings about the blues and I feel like his hip hop can be bluesy if not too lyrically complex for the blues. Though he sings, my sadness is a hound dog on this one, which is a nice blues reference. Arc Door starts, it's just a drum, and then it develops into a fatter sound. I like the reference to Mr. Wendell. He challenges any billionaire to a game of horseshoes. And, and I like how he says that. I challenge any billionaire to a game of horseshoes. Lampiano's Flow is a cool backing track. All these tracks can be easily translated into a live set with a band and a DJ. Tennessee Farmer Jutsu, he uses some reversing on this track, which is a neat effect. Boot knife, he has a little fun with the vocals here. He uses odd emphasis, which I like. He doesn't have to be this like tough rapper. He doesn't have to sound like everyone else. He does his own thing. And for that, I give this a vinyl please. Thank you for listening, guys. Like, subscribe, and please leave me a comment with your thoughts. Peace, guys.